So, good morning, ladies and germs, or whenever you're seeing this video. So, I just found out that McDonald's has what they call a double Big Mac. I like food. I like McDonald's. Let's give this a review. We're here to do a food review, right? <laughs> and so I got a little platter here so you can see everything. And let's go ahead and see this burger. Whoop. Ooh, that was going to fall over. Well, we're going to put you there so you don't fall over. All right, so what we got here. Okay, so basically it's a regular Big Mac. But with four patties instead of two. So this may be a personal challenge. I don't know if I can do it or not. I'm going to put you there. And of course, we forgot to get something to drink. Let me get my legs over. I think I will situate myself under this desk a little bit better, but who would know? <laughs> All right, so let's see. Let's put this out because you're here to see the food and it is beautiful. So, that looks like a little good little boat to put my french fries in. And yes, I did share this french fries. That has way too much fries to give you one of this. So me and my wife, we split this. She took half, I took the other half and we both got a really good portion on that. <laughs> oh, if you want to, oh God, it's so good. <laughs> mm, you don't even need ketchup for that. Oh my God. Mm. But a trick to getting real, to make sure your french fries are fresh, is you can ask for, mm, you can ask your french fries to be made with no salt. And the people will do that. It's a pain in the ass, but they'll do it. Of course, you shouldn't be asking for salt when you pick up your food. Uh -uh, and that gets so real. Or you could just say, can you fry me up a, fr a fresh batch? Um, honesty may work. Who knows? <laughs> You think it'll catch on? <laughs> mm. Okay, now we're gonna taste this little thing. Mm. And it's still warm. Oh my God, look at that cheese. Look at that cheese. <laughs> mm. it's, it's dripping with toppings. If I showed you, I'd just leave a trail of toppings. Okay, here we go. Mm. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm. 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 Oh my God, I need to put that aside. I need to concentrate on this burger. You think a single burger is good? Hmm. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. So is this a food review or is this a muffin? I can't tell. It tastes delicious. My God, look at all that meat. Look at all that. That is not a bad. That is not bad. For the money, that's a good piece of meat right there, I'm telling you. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Oh my God, it's a huge piece of pickle. Mmm. Oh my God, I got sesame seeds all over here. This thing. It's so loaded down. It ain't funny. Mm-mm. And they don't skimp on this at all. At all. Okay. 
I don't know why, what's up, what makes it different, but this is different. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. Oh. My saucy is filling out. <laughs> That's okay, I got a salad down here. <laughs> Mm -hmm. mm. I'm fine, guys. I'm trying to be neat about this, but it's not working. Oh my god, this is so good. Mm. Mm. Yeah, a sandwich, a side, and a salad. Wait, there's a salad in here. There's so much. Mm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh God, I love these French fries. Mm. You know what other French fries I like? Mm. Oh God, it's so good. Mm. Um, the Carl's Jr. or Hardee's, depending on what region of the country you're in. It's all the same company, just different names. Anyway, they have the curly fries. Oh my god. Mm hmm. Now those are good. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Oh, nice. This is so good. They gave me a couple napkins in here, which they always give me one. Mm hmm. Okay, here we go. That nice juicy bite. It's going to be messy. You don't like mess, you turn your face away right now. Here we go. Mm. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh my God, it's good. Mm. 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 Oh, that is so yummy. I need mean, more nothing, sorry. Yeah, that's gotta go there. Okay. Uh, on my upper lip. <laughs> uh, oh, wait. That is so good. My God. Why didn't they do this sooner? Why well, has it been that long since I had Big Mac? But a minute, I normally don't eat these, but I saw this and I was like, I have to. Mm. 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 Mm -mm. And you don't believe me, but this salad in here. <laughs> mm -hmm. If I showed you everything, I just spill it all out, and I don't want to, really, I don't. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 Not necessarily the burger. That sauce is so addictive. My um, neighbor is doing some gardening work. I can't complain because I'm going to be doing that a few days too. <laughs> so don't worry about it. I'm good. I'm good with that. Anyone that wants to do gardening work, you really need to. Um, I think we all need to get back to growing our own food. Because at the rate 
Mm. At the rate the prices are going, I bet you we're going to need to soon. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. But that's another video. <laughs> mm. Mm. Okay. Here we go. Mm. Here we go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's mainly what it is. It's the sauce. And if you want to know how to make the sauce, it's real simple. You take your favorite barbecue sauce and you add it to some mayonnaise. Uh, not too much. You do not need a lot of barbecue sauce in the mayonnaise. Do not, so, do not use Miracle Whip. Miracle Whip has too much sugar, not enough vinegar, not enough garlic. Uh, mayonnaise has more vinegar, less sugar, more garlic, um, you know, more vinegar, more su I would say the salt is about the same, but mayonnaise definitely have more salt, more vinegar, more garlic, more onion powder, more seasonings. The reason why, because if you read on the bottom in teeny tiny letters on the Miracle Whip jar, it says salad dressing. You can put it on whatever you want. You want to put it on your sandwich, your potatoes, whatever. It's your food. I ain't telling you what to do. I'm just telling you what it says on the label. And on the label of the Miracle Whip and teeny tiny letters along the bottom, it says sandwich dressing. It's for sandwiches. Not, <laughs> not you know, it's not the same as mayonnaise. Mayonnaise is different. Well, to me it tastes completely different. But then again, I grew up on mayonnaise. Anyway, I veered off course. <laughs> You must, it's imperative you use real mayonnaise. Um, I would say a three to one ratio because the, the barbecue sauce is really overpowering, uh, but you don't want it too much. You want to bring it to the, you're going for the color. So you get the cup, of, I would say a cup of mayonnaise and just add a little bit of barbecue sauce until you get the right color you like. And then you add, uh, it has to be dill relish. So three ingredients, that's all you need. Some dill relish, mayonnaise, and barbecue sauce. If you like more dill relish, I wish there was more. If you wanted more oomph in your sauce and you wish there was more, now you know the ingredients. You can make it yourself, fry up your own hamburgers, and you got your own, I don't know, McDonald hack. Ooh, we learned a hack. <laughs> it's an old recipe I learned years ago. Anyway, let me go ahead and finish my food. And I'm just about done. Mmm. 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 Mm. Yeah, I think I'll save the fries. I'm doing good just to get this in. Uh, if you know someone with a big appetite, one of these will fill them up. Mmm. 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 Mm-hmm. 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 Mm. Now we'll have a little bit of salad. <laughs> mm -hmm. Eat your vegetables. <laughs> mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. Mm -mm. Mm. Mm. Yep. <laughs> okay. Oh. 
<laughs> and yes, I have a test right here. Anyone that's new to this channel, yes, I have a trash. Anyone who's not new knows I have a trash can back here. You never know when you're going to need it. And I'm going to have to take this to the kitchen to wash it. What it is, it's my temptation cake holder. <laughs> Because that's how far up the food has to be for you to see it. And also, let me turn it around because this has slather and mayonnaise on it. But if you don't need it for a cake holder, it's a dish and dip. <laughs> Ain't that cute? What you like, parties. So you can either put your dip in here and the different chips in there. Or flip it around. And put your cake on there. The only unitasker, oh yeah, and it comes apart. So you can put this on one side and then on the other side. And I see I need to clean my um that rubber thingy, the gasket. <laughs> okay, there you go. Yeah, I'm gonna have to wash that. Mm. I'm going to have to check the gasket. Yeah, that's not supposed to slide out so easily. But anyway, yeah, that was really good. Um, I'm very happy, very full. I mean, if you're not full after that, something's wrong. <laughs> I mean, I'm a big eater, but I ain't even I have my limits. <laughs> Um, and that wasn't bad at all. I, I love these fries. Oh my God. Mm. Okay. So what do I think of it? I think the, I think the sandwich is gone. <laughs> uh, I hope they keep it around for a little while. I think it's a good bargain. Price wise, it's not too expensive. Um, and I think, I don't know, I mean, if, it's okay for once in a while to have a burger. I mean, God, you can't, you can't be happy off of steamed vegetables all the time. You have a little spice in your life, you know. So here we are, and I guess this is the end of the video. Not much to say, all I did was eat a burger. Um, my only thing is, I'm not sure what to name it. I never did one like this before. It's always been taste testing um, subscription boxes or unboxing a packet or something. I mean, technically, this would be a mukbang, wouldn't it? But that contains a lot of food. I really didn't eat a lot of food. I ate one burger. I mean, I tried eating a lot of food. I can't do it. I mean, I ate one burger and that's it. So as a mukbang, I don't think I'll make it. I'll just call it what it is. I think I'll decide on double Big Mac review. I mean, it's the truth. Anyway, thank you for watching this. I hope you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed making it. Uh, let's hope for the best. We're going to prepare for the worst. And I guarantee you, we're all going to end up somewhere in the middle. So until we meet next time, bye. Bye.